What's going on guys? Welcome to the TUS Evil Rabbit YouTube channel. My name's Not Evil Rabbit and I'm here not playing Talk Drift for you all. Is that a good intro? Are we, are we <laughs> rolling with that? Hey, this works. I'm not gonna lie. What's up, everybody? I'm Evil Rabbit, and I'm joined here by TUS Ranga, my teammate for SSR. We are working on some new SSR cars. Even though I will be missing round two Long Beach, he will not be. So we're going to try and get some cars tuned in and dialed in. I am thinking of switching to a V8 370, and he is working his Volvo for his love of Volvos. So we're going to do some testing here on Long Beach, maybe hit up Road Atlanta. But uh, it's time to test and tune some new cars because uh, I was not too happy with the... Uh, boss s14 as i thought it was gonna be and uh i know the v8 hate is gonna be all over me but you know what if it works it works so we're gonna get to it have some slides as he's already on my door i can't see so let's just get to it and tune <laughs> these cars <laughs> Well, that cone kind of messed up my line. Oh, I didn't think I was going to save I that. I tried. <laughs> <laughs> I just if, uh, I let the clutch in and just sort of let the car slide into you a little bit and was like, there's no point in even trying because I'll end up going like really hard into him. See, if, if, For if Forza had cr um, like crushable bumpers, I would have been okay. Because it was just the gentle oh, yeah, definitely. wall graze, but just enough to completely just, screw up my line. Just wait until I lead. The back bumpers on this thing are amazing, right? Wait. Let's just put it this way. If I hit the wall a certain way, I get grabbed and launched in. <laughs> oh, be careful of the hitbox on the corners as well, because this is Forza. That was a bit wonky. Kinda still right there though. Oh, a little door love on the last hairpin. I'm okay with that. That was a nice solid <laughs> run though. <laughs> that was yeah, pretty solid. Yeah, kind of uh, what's, what's the word? Kind of just keeping it simple. And not I mean, it long. was a very conservative run, but it was conservative, no conservative, but it was enough to uh, show justice to two new builds that you know haven't really been tested. Uh, I'd love to agree, but I spent like three hours testing this car yesterday. I'm just a player, basically. <laughs> I built this on stream and was like, yes guys, we built a Volvo for SSR spec. This was built for the last round. And I've tweaked the tune so much that it works on here now. That's awesome. Yeah, I've, uh, I kind of wanted to go to a Z chassis. I've been wanting to for a while. 32 is great. 33 is decent, 34 is probably the more competitive one. Oh. Oh, oh! I lost grip there in the front. I need to change tire pressures. Actually, you know what? I oh, think I, I know what happened. I think, uh, I don't think the soft front, I the front end dived a little bit and it caused the front end to wash out. I need to stiffen the front for the LS. So we're gonna do uh, that. Yes. Try that. Um, I noticed. Right, this is gonna be really embarrassing. Right, I tuned this car originally with the stock engine in, put the LS in, got to 500 horsepower, got all the torque and everything that I wanted, got it working really well. But I didn't yeah. change the suspension settings, and began to have this massive problem with understeer. Was like really struggling to get this understeer out of the car. Just couldn't get it to work. Did like three or four hours testing off stream. Could not get it to work. So I ended up using the S13, like for the actual competition. Got back in the car, realized what I'd done, softened the front end, and it felt like easy. Like, no, I could have used the Volvo and got an 88.1. Hey, at least you didn't zero. <laughs> oh, yeah, definitely. I did. I might be going on the SSR podcast that they're doing. 
Nice. Because, you know, I'm everyone's favorite to US member. Oh, that's much better. Oh, that's so solid. I could, I kind of just put the car to lock and it stayed there. <laughs> I was full locked that entire bank that or that entire nice sweeper. I was full lock and just matted and it just held it. Kind of just boop. Yeah, no, that was an incredible one. I am so happy with how this Z handles. It handles it much really better. Good. It's nice to follow as well. It's nice. It's much better with the LS in it. it so, kudos to you for making me switch to an LS. It's smooth. I like it. I know we are, and Siki makes a lot for the Z's. Shameless plug to Siki Motorsports. Yeah. Make sure you check Actually, out Siki Motorsports. Really <laughs> yes, please. If you go to Siki MFG, tell them Ranga sent you. You won't get anything off. Just tell them Ranga sent you. I might get a T-shirt then. Hello. Good guess. One day I'm going to enter and not get the entire thing. Oh, okay. Oh, I Water. lost my tail light. <laughs> I tapped it and lost my tail light. I, I really, I've, I've got to give it to Pat, but at the same time, I know he probably won't win. I love Pat so much, but I don't know as far as battles go if he could do it. Um, I think he's definitely a good enough driver. I think he's got the same problem that Adam lz has got, where the sort of mental stuff gets to him. Oh, that's really short. But yeah, I managed to good. pull that out, though. The Z is much yeah, more forgiving than that 14. Holy cow. Oh, yeah, definitely. Um, what was I going to say, though? Yeah, I, I really want to give it to Pat. I think somebody like Asbo... Asbo's probably going to have another couple of questionable calls. Like Atlanta, <laughs> I think... <laughs> Ryan Turk may do quite well. So um, I'm hoping that Dean Kearney can do decent. If his car runs. Do you know? Oh, that's a wall. Oh, fuck <laughs> off. Bear with me. Because you went away anyways, so that way there wasn't this lull yeah. that I had to find and eliminate. <laughs> um, yeah, that's fine. So do you honestly know who I think might win Long, or, uh, Long Beach uh, Jersey? Uh, go for it. Forrest Wang. Because last time he was in Jersey was a controversial call. And that's what made him kind of leave oh, FD. Oh, yeah, the over angle. So, I think he's gunning for blood this year. To prove something. Well, he's already shown that he's a bit more competitive this year. Oh, oh God, I just bummed you off now. I was able to help hold um, that, though. <laughs> Um, are you back recording now, then, I'm guessing? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah, no, I think, um, I think Wang's call in New Jersey last year was right. Although it wasn't I, last I year, it was the year before. You know what I meant. Anyway, <laughs> I think it was right. Um, I well, think a here's... really big thing was that you have to have a followable lead, and if you're but here's the like thing, crazy though. angle... Here's the reason well, I don't agree with it. Because he was doing that the entire event. It wasn't just that run that he did it in. He did. He was doing that over angle and high angle through that section every run the entire event. So it wasn't just something new. Oh, no, that's fair. Yeah, no, that, that is fair. That's a fair point. But at the same time, it is still... If somebody meant to follow that, you know, you want to get through the course smoothly. And if you do that, you know, especially, like, thinking about it from the falls of Georgia, because that's the only experience I've got. Oh my god. Oh, I just punted you. <laughs> <laughs> the other one is old FD. Yeah, the other one's from when the cars have 500 horsepower. I just rarely fumble. Oh yeah, easily can do this one. Oh, oh yeah, easily. Oh, it's only over angle there, but I saved it. So that. Oh, God. Trying to get a pass on oh, me? Oh, no. 
All right, I'm gonna follow you. Okay, are we doing old or new? Uh, do new. Oh. Okay. I thought All you would right, hit the brakes. Uh, okay. So did I, to be fair, but my foot missed. I can drive in a straight line, I promise. Look at the concentration. Look at the focus. Oh, I understeered. Damn it. It's not a focus, mate. It's a Volvo. <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm looking at the Volvo like this shouldn't be sliding the way it's sliding, and I lost focus for a second. You still have both taillights, though. I know. That's what I mean. Like. What's up? I cannot get it. I cannot get enough about their fucking logo. <laughs> <laughs> you don't like that logo. Oh. Also, that fucking that fucking run was awesome. Yeah, this car that is I'm so much smoother in this car. I think it's the extra weight. I think I'm better in heavier cars. I think that's why I'm good in my C5 Corvette because it's heavier. No, uh, I believe so. Since you, when you are using the 900, obviously. Smoother. Yes, I think heavier car makes smoother. <laughs> oh yeah, definitely. Tapped it. Come on, tap it. You just did, and I just did it right behind you, too. <laughs> Beautiful. That run felt so good. It looked good. Good thing I'm recording it. Jeez. Good thing I was recording. God damn! <laughs> Believe me, there was a lot of shitty runs with me. Getting good runs. Oh, crap. I oh, told of course. You so. <laughs> I don't know. When I'm practicing, it's way different. And then I when you're like actually I'm competing? Perfect. Yeah. Yeah, when I'm actually qualifying, I don't feel the nervousness or pressure in the, when I'm qualifying or competing, but every now and then, I still tend to mess up for some reason. I don't know. It's everybody. I held on to it. I almost over angled, but I held on to the angle. Whoa. Yeah, I actually a little bit pushed you. Yeah, you probably wrong, helped me. But that was. Dude, that was sick. That was sick run. Much more comfortable in a Z. Forest bird flies. Yup. <laughs> Except I got a V8. You actually, you actually do look good in it. So. It's smoother. Yeah. I know. 
know you dare. Kiss me. <laughs> yeah, I'm right there. I'm still there. Uh, I missed, yeah, I missed up my last corner. I wasn't as smooth as I needed. That's way too much angle. Overall, pretty good run. Yeah, it wasn't bad. I can do better. I can do better. I've seen better. Ain't no shit. <laughs> Damn. I just drove behind you and you are hella smooth. I don't know how, but <laughs> hella fucking smooth on my 900. Uh, yep, what the fuck? on 900 too. <laughs> That's what I'm telling you. <laughs> it's insane. Pretty much in my book, you're already a winner. Oh, oh, I cut that way bad. short. And I came in way too fast. So both of us made I need tires. <laughs> hey, it works. Oh. Yep, that's Long Beach. Yep. That's mm -hmm. yep. You're done. <laughs> mm -hmm. That's so. what it actually needs to do. My the S14 was never this smooth. Ah, oh, it would have been good. <laughs> kind of similar. Whatever. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I don't know how I was able to stay in that. I was complete full lock. And it just stayed an angle. I was like, uh, uh, okay, I'm gonna continue the track even though I'm full lock. <laughs> if I get it right, I usually go complete full lock to that whole sweeper. And I'm full lock, don't even move. If I get it right. Which is very scary because then it's like, uh, I could over angle real fast. about the person who's behind you. If I didn't mess up my uh, follow on the initiation, it would be brilliant. Yep. I uh, did a little bit too much of a tail tap on the sweeper, but it didn't mess me up too bad. As long as you are smooth, you can tap it. As long as you are smooth and it doesn't give you that much of a correction, you are all good. Yeah, if you see sparks and the tail light breaks, that's better. Oh, yeah. If you mess up, like, hit and correct, then it's all fucked up. It is a, such a little mistake, but it uh, counts a lot. Oh, yeah. Like in real life. Oh, 
Holy shit! No way! No way, dude! No way! Doors! <laughs> no way!